Decomposition happens when a molecule breaks down. It decomposes because of heat energy that's being applied to it. So if you imagine the molecule itself is a, a particle with all these different bits, and when you heat it up, one of the particles or parts of the particle breaks off so you end up with two separate bits of particle. Now the examples that you need at common entrance are copper carbonate, calcium carbonate, and there's a, a little mention of potassium manganate 7 in a, in a different context. So copper carbonate, you start off with copper carbonate, you heat it up, it forms copper oxide. which is a solid, and it releases carbon dioxide. Which is a gas. If you can't read my hieroglyphics, you'll just have to listen. But the colours of these different things, copper carbonate is a green colour. A kind of aquamarine, but don't write that, just write green. Copper oxide is a black powder. And carbon dioxide is a colourless gas. If you're watching this from America, that's how you spell colourless. Another one that you need to know is calcium carbonate. Calcium carbonate is, is limestone or chalk, it's chemically, that's, that's what it is. And it's, it's usually presented as a white powder. And calcium carbonate, when it breaks down, forms calcium oxide. which is also a white powder, and it releases carbon dioxide. Which is a colourless gas. So you start off with a white powder, you finish with a white powder, and a colourless gas that you can't see has been released. So they don't ask you about the colours, or any colour changes rather, with the thermal decomposition of calcium carbonate. Now the third example, which you see more in gases of the air, is potassium manganate 7, which in the olden days, when, when I was younger, was called potassium permanganate. And this releases oxygen when it thermally decomposes. You don't need to know the chemistry behind any of this, but it's nice to have a, a bit of an idea about some of the colours. So potassium permanganate starts off as a purple colour. When you heat it up, uh, you end up with this pink colour. If you get it on your hands, it turns brown. Uh, and it releases oxygen, which again is colourless. My handwriting seems to get worse, not better with age. 